Hi, I'm here today to tell you a little bit about opacity versus transparency when using Winsor Newton Professional Acrylics. Opacity and transparency are fascinating paint qualities which need to be understood. I'm going to demonstrate this by scraping colours over a black line without adding any solvents or mediums to the paint. And as you will see, some colours will cover this black line completely and some will allow the black line to show through. The mass tone of a colour can often look the same. When you squeeze the tube onto your palette, for example, the colour may appear very much to a colour adjacent, but the moment that you start using that colour, you will see that it behaves differently. It can either be opaque or transparent. I'm going to demonstrate this by first of all showing two different reds. Cadmium Red Deep is very opaque and because of that it obliterates the black line underneath. Whilst Quinacodrone Red is a transparent colour and it allows the black line to show through. You can see the same happening with this Cobalt Blue. This is a very opaque colour whilst French Ultramarine allows the black line underneath to come through. As you can see, Cadmium Red and Cobalt Blue are both very opaque colours, whilst Quinacridone Red and French Ultramarine are much more transparent. Transparent colours are ideal for glazing, whilst these more opaque colours offer a greater coverage. When selecting your palette, don't just think about colour selection, but having a mixture of opaque and transparent colours. Traditionally, red iron oxide and chromium oxide of green have been used for underpainting because they're both very opaque colours. I hope this helps with your paint selection.